It's been about a month since classes have let out, but since you've been gone, a lot has happened in the Charlotte sports world. We're going to kick things off with football, where the season is quickly approaching and things are heating up on the field. Conference USA announced their preseason teams. Charlotte placed three players on the squads. Nate Davis, a 6'3 redshirt junior offensive lineman, was named to the second team. After recording a team-high 51 solo tackles, two interceptions, and one fumble recovery for 59 yards, sophomore Ben DeLuca was named to the third team preseason all -time. With averaging 35.8 yards per game last season, senior T.L. Ford begins his final season with the 49ers, being named on the fourth team preseason all -time. They also released their preliminary television schedule, with Charlotte slated to have five games broadcasted. The coaching scene has also changed for the 49ers this offseason. Aaron Curry, who's coached the defensive line the past few seasons, stepped down June 2nd, citing personal reasons. Following his departure, Charlie Skaleski stepped up to be special teams coordinator, and head coach Brad Lambert has taken over the defensive line. This is a good looking D-line right here. Hard work on three. One, two, three. Hard work. Coaching changes have also been made for the 49ers on the hardwood this offseason. Mark Price and the men's basketball team hired Serbia native Ivo Samovic as an assistant coach. Samovic, fun fact, has an NBA championship ring from when he coached with the 2014 Antonio Spurs. Coming in with Samovic is a 6'7 Serbian guard Luka Vasic. Vasic is ranked the 6th best player in Connecticut by ESPN.com. On the women's side of the ball, Randy Henderson stepped down from her assistant coaching position here at Charlotte to take a head coaching job at Washington State University outside of St. Louis. Caroline Sang received not one, but two All-American nods this past week in the NCAA Track and Field Championship. Sang finished 8th in the 10,000-meter race and 12th in the 5,000-meter race. The Charlotte women's soccer team, coming off their championship winning season, released their schedule. The lineup includes teams like Wake Forest, Georgia, University of South Florida, and ECU. For all the latest Charlotte sports information, stay tuned to NinerTimes.com. I'm Kathleen Cook, and I'll see you around.